Our Island Story, A History of Britain for Boys and Girls, by H. E. Marshall is a timeless classic that presents the history of Britain in a captivating and accessible manner. Published in 1905, it was intended to educate and entertain young readers, but its engaging narrative style and vivid storytelling have also made it a beloved work for readers of all ages. Marshall's approach to recounting history is deeply rooted in storytelling. Instead of presenting dry facts and dates, she weaves together tales of kings, queens, battles, and adventures, bringing the past to life with vibrant imagery in rich detail. Through her narrative, she invites readers to journey through the centuries, from ancient times to the modern era, experiencing the triumphs and tribulations of Britain's past. One of the key strengths of Our Island Story is Marshall's ability to make history relatable and relevant to her audience. By focusing on the human aspect of historical events, she allows readers to empathize with the people who shaped Britain's destiny. Whether it's the bravery of Queen Boadicea leading her people against Roman invaders or the cunning of King Alfred outwitting the Danes, Marshall highlights the courage, ambition, and resilience of the individuals who left their mark on British history. Moreover, Marshall's portrayal of British history is not limited to the deeds of monarchs and warriors, she also incorporates the everyday lives of ordinary people. From peasants to merchants, soldiers to sailors, she provides glimpses into the diverse experiences of different social classes throughout the ages. By doing so, she offers a more holistic view of history, acknowledging the contributions of all members of society to the shaping of the nation. In addition to its engaging narrative style, our island story is notable for its patriotic tone and emphasis on national identity. Marshall celebrates Britain's achievements and glorifies its historical figures, fostering a sense of pride and loyalty among her readers. Through her writing, she instills in them a love for their country and a desire to uphold its traditions and values. However, it is important to recognize that Our Island Story reflects the biases and perspectives of its time. Written in the early 20th century, it presents a largely Eurocentric and Anglocentric view of history, overlooking the contributions of other cultures and peoples to the development of Britain. Additionally, Marshall's narrative tends to romanticize certain aspects of history, glossing over the darker chapters such as colonialism, imperialism, and social inequality. Despite these limitations, our island story remains a valuable resource for understanding and appreciating British history. Its engaging storytelling, colorful characters, and patriotic spirit continue to captivate readers and inspire curiosity about the past. Moreover, it serves as a reminder of the power of storytelling to bring history to life and connect us to our shared heritage. In conclusion, Our Island Story, A History of Britain for Boys and Girls, by H. E. Marshall is a classic work that has stood the test of time. Through its engaging narrative style, relatable characters, and patriotic tone, it offers readers a captivating journey through the annals of British history. While it may reflect the biases of its era, its enduring popularity attests to its lasting impact as a beloved literary portrayal of the past.